Herzlich willkommen zurück zu Let's Play The Walking Dead Episode 2. Wir sind auf einer Farm einer Molkerei von einer Familie, die im Austausch gegen Benzin uns Nahrungsmittel mitgegeben hat für unsere Leute und die Carly oder Carly, wie sie ausgesprochen wird, sie ist jetzt zurückgegangen, um die anderen zu holen, weil es hier recht sicher scheint. Ich überprüfte gerade hier die Zäune und als wir auf der anderen Seite des Zauns waren, ging der Strom wieder an und wir werden attackiert. Hm, von irgendwelchen Menschen. Fuck is that? No idea. Fuck. Now what? With the fence on that gate is our only way out. Tja. Was nun? Give us the food. Quick, please. We're stuck in the dirt. Fuck you, so bitch. No. Tja, ich sehe noch keinen. So, jetzt können wir den mal was nach vorne schieben. Okay, das bewegt sich nicht. Ja, wie kriege ich das aus der Erde raus? Ah, hier mit dem Schalter. Zombie. What happened? Shit. It's one of the dead we pushed down earlier. We're gonna have to move. Yeah, so they had some kind of life force. Wow. Okay, that's better. Come, strong. Okay, that's not enough. We have to get him first. We have to get him first. Another one? How many of those things did we push down? I think we have not pushed them. Okay. So ist es. Da fest er drauf. Ach du Jesus. Bist du okay? Ja. Fair. Komm her. Die Gäste sind da. Wir haben einen Frieden. Jetzt bist du fucked. Hmm. Tja, so, so sicher ist es da nicht. Lee, what's wrong? The electric fence came on. Started attacking from the woods, and we got trapped between them and the fence. Holy shit! Are are you okay? I heard Mark yelling. Thought y'all were giving me the all clear. Man, I am real sorry. Oh my lord! What happened to you, sweetheart? It was those bastards in the woods, Mama. Yeah, I'll be all right once it's out. But God damn, it hurts. Hey y'all. Mark. Oh my God! What happened? He got shot with an arrow. Christ! Are you gonna be okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I should just pull it out. Oh no, honey. Come on. Brenda's got you. Come on inside now. We'll have you all sorted out. Well, you must be the best. What kind of shit is this? We ran into some people on the way up here. Bandits, I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning. Killed a bunch of our farmhands. We were able to get them to stop by making a deal. You knew about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. God damn it! Carly said this place was locked down tight. 
Maybe it isn't as safe here as we thought. Look, we're sorry. We, we never had them screw with us like this. Not since we started giving them food. Listen, we may have had an agreement with those people, but we will not stand for this shit. Ain't no way we're gonna let those sons of bitches get away with this. You know where these assholes are? They're hard to pin down, but I think I know where at least one of their camps are. When you're ready to go scope out that bandit camp, come find us. Bandits? Are you serious? This place isn't safe. We can't stay here. Not safe? This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor inn. I think all of us and our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. What we need to do is find a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Oh, cool your jets there, Rambo. These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown out before we eat. <laughs> I'm gonna head out and help Dan deal with these bandits. You guys should try to make friends with Andy and Brenda while I'm gone. Well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Yeah, that's real charming, Dad. Where's Ben and Carly? Since Carly and Ben ate some of the food on the way to get us, she volunteered to stay behind and watch the motor in until we get back. Hey, uh, I remember seeing kids in your group, so I went ahead and fixed that swing while you were out. I hope your kids like swings. A swing? I love swings, just like at my treehouse. Come on, Doc. Das Why don't you kids go play on the swing, huh? so Yeah. Mist. Thanks. Anytime. We're looking out for you. Hmm. Na toll. Das war doch meine Idee. Hey, Clem. Do you like the swing? Yeah, it's fun. Be sure to tell Andy thank you, okay? I will. Hmm, cool. Will you push me on it? Sure. Happy to push you on this way. Mind if Clementine takes a turn? All right, Duck. Let Clementine have a try for a bit. Okay. What do you think of the dairy? It's pretty. It reminds me of how things used to look before. Yeah, it does. Do you think things will ever get back to how they were? Yeah, I'm not sure when. One day. That's things good. Got to get back. That's good. I hope it's soon. Yeah, me too. Don't worry, we're safe here now. As long as the bad people don't get me too, right? I won't let what happened to Mark happen to you. Promise? I promise. How you holding up, Clementine? I'm okay, I guess. Are you okay? Yeah. I'm just a little worried about Mark. Is Mark going to be okay? He got lucky out there. Could have been a lot worse. Are you going to find the people who hurt Mark? Then we have to make sure they don't hurt anyone else. Be careful. I want you to stay lucky, too. Ever since I met you, I've had good luck, so don't worry. Okay. All right, Clem. That's enough for now. Okay. Thanks for pushing me. Of course. It's all yours. Yeah! Okay, Doug, don't pop a gasket. Hey. Haley, found anything interesting? I was talking to Andy a bit earlier. Doesn't sound like they have too many guns around. They rely mostly on the fence to keep them safe. So long as you're on this side, things are all right. Out of the fence holds out. Well, that's the problem. When there's no more gas, there's no more fence. That's true. Well, it's good to know what we're working with here. Keep looking around. And let me know if you find anything else. Did Duck and Katja get here okay? No, it wasn't easy. Duck didn't look so good on the walk over to this place. Well, if everything works out, maybe he and Katja can have an easier life here. I hope you're right. Duck and Clementine deserve a better life than starving to death at some crappy motel. How you holding up? I hope they feed us, Lee. Soon. On the way over here, I was getting dizzy. Hands shaking, cold sweats. Thought I was gonna pass out. They've got food here. Yeah, but I'm not just talking about one meal, you know? I'm gonna go have a look around. Don't wait too long to help scope out that bandit camp. It'd be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about the St. John's and their relationship with those bandits or whatever. 
Right. I'll see what I can find out. Checken wir direkt nochmal alles ab hier. Generator. Können wir hier hingehen? Looks like a feeding station for the cow. Ja, die Kuh soll ja krank sein. Ich hoffe nicht, dass die infiziert ist. Okay, mit dem kann ich gar nicht quatschen. Oh mein Gott, ich bin so glad you two didn't get killed out there. Do you think Mark will be okay? Wish I knew, but I think he's in good hands now. Yeah? It's not too bad? He'll be fine. I've seen guys go through worse. How could you all bring us to this place? How do you feel about leaving the motor in? It's a welcome change of scenery. I don't know. If we just stayed where we were, then Mark wouldn't have ended up with an arrow in his shoulder. I uh, take it you and Kenny didn't exactly make up on the way here. I tried seeing things from his point of view, having a wife and kid and everything. But gambling with your family's life is pretty stupid if you ask me. Lee. I know you and Kenny are friends, but you recognize that he's not the right person to lead this group, don't you? Kenny believes there's still hope. Maybe that's what we need right now. Well, hope doesn't do any good if we're all dead. I'm focused on keeping us alive. And not giving my dad food. That was cold. Okay. Dafür hab ich dir Essen gegeben. Schade, dass ich nicht rennen kann. Schauen wir uns mal die Kuh an. If there's not enough room in the house for all of us, I guess a few of us could camp out here in ships. Okay, geht da nicht rein. Lots of hay. Hmm. Enough of these might work as adequate cover for arrows, if that becomes a problem. How you feeling, Lee? Look, I'm really sorry you almost got killed out there. Uh, we should have told you how dangerous it was. No shit. You saw what they did to your buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. But how? The two of us should go out and do some recon. Then we'll all mount up for some revenge. Hell yeah. Who the fuck are these people in the woods? We don't know. I think some of them used to work at the big box up the way. Save lots. Yeah. Anyway, they're nutty as all hell and get mad when they're hungry. So, are you ready to head out there and find their camp? Let's yeah. go. It'll be a good opportunity to find out a bit more Machen about what we're up against. Let's do it. I'll stay here and hold down the fort. Remember, we're just doing reconnaissance for now. No use getting ourselves killed. Are you going now? Yeah, I'll be back soon, Clementine. Please be lucky. I will. See anything? So, auf der Jagd nach dem Banditen. Das machen wir im nächsten Take. Bis zum nächsten Mal. Euer Trojan.